Welcome back, you wee leprechauns, the Deus Ex Human Revolution Director's Cut. Last time, we were coerced by Commander Keitner to figure out what this black project at the Rifleman Bank Station is all about. We also met this colorful character, Garvin Quinn, who has promised to construct us a rocket launcher provided that we bring him all the parts. And that'll be on the agenda for today. Actually, today's agenda is all secrets. Probably not going to actually progress the plot, but we will get the scope that we need for our rocket launcher this episode. Along with tons of other things. Including this, 100 experience points. And, what's that? A damage upgrade! Something I actually need for my pistol. Alright, so we'll go ahead and work our way back. A lot of man-sized vents here, just like every other place in this game. Go and how's my inventory looking? Yeah, it's kind of stuffed to the brim. I'm gonna drop off some of my stuff here because I am gonna be seeing Quinn again, right? As soon as I get all the rocket launcher parts. All right, let's go ahead and drop you. You drop, drop it, drop it. There you go. Combine you with that. And we'll make another EMP mine. They actually are very handy in this section, as you should find out. If not this episode, next episode. We'll put the beer by the grenades. That sounds like a good place. I'll even color coordinate them. There you go, see? Perfect. There we go. Let's see. Peps, I don't need you. I don't actually think there's any Peps ammunition in this place. But I could be wrong. Let's see. Drop you there. Candy bars, you can go there. Perfect. Actually, you know what? It's bothering me. There we go. Now they're perfect. There's just a pile of garbage. You know, I don't like the way that you're undulating there. I feel like the game's going to just explode. In fact, I can't even see my pets. All right. Let's see. All right. Let's try over here. Maybe this is the proper area. Oh, come on. Drop it. Sometimes the drag and drop for some reason just doesn't work. And you know what? I don't need the hypo stems right now either. There you go. Perfect. Alright. You're... Okay, you've said it. Good. Good, 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 good. Those will be back here when we come back here. And now we have plenty of space to fill up with new goodies. Which we are going to be picking up. Of course, we don't need a space for the uh, scope that we're going to pick up for the rocket launcher, because that's just how it works. Oh my gosh, you almost saw me! You didn't really see me. It was just an illusion. Your mind is playing tricks on you, camera. Alright. So the first destination, you'll notice that door is locked, but this one, not so much. We can just pop in here. And we have a computer. Let's go ahead and hack it. What do we got, D. Coverly? I think I actually should buy the hacking upgrades pretty soon. I think I got the points for them. There we go. It doesn't even know we're in here. Maybe I don't need the upgrades. Access granted. But hell, what, el what else am I going to spend them on? Now, like I mentioned before, there's a civil war going on in Australia, folks. We have two sides. We have... The Southern Australia... Was it Front or... No, it's Federation. Southern Australia Federation. And we have the Free States of Australia. Bell Towers currently helping the SAF. The Southern Australia Federation. And that's what this email is about here. Also got some advice about unprivileged belligerents at this camp. As well as uh, people not feeling so good about Go. And we also have implementation of a new mess schedule, which is important for soldiers, folks. They like to eat. All right, there's one more thing in here. I say, come on now. I say you come on now. There you go. Good. If we take this around, it'll actually lead us to that room that I pointed out earlier that was locked. And in that room is something we need. Something that we actually have been searching for very recently. You know that whole scope assembly? Here it is. Let's go ahead and take a look at that real quick. Let's see, there's all the other parts. Look at it. There we go. 
I also have a pistol. I'll go ahead and pick that up for no particular reason. What else do we have? We have credit, candy bars, and painkillers. You can keep your painkillers. What we got here? Let's see, code for the communication security. That's neat. And we have a magazine here. Which will give you a little more background on the whole conflict in Australia. Oh, it's not southern, it's just south. Okay, South Australia front. You gotta remember this, Lee. It'll not be dumb. Alright, we also have a computer in here. JY. Let's see what we got. Oh my goodness. You know that whole upgrading thing? We're gonna do that real quick. Alright, so we just need four, five. I don't really need robot domination for this section of the game. And we have but one practice point remaining. My goodness. Alright. Now, hopefully, what I just did will make this a little easier, because even though this is only a level 2 system, it's fairly complex. I can't just rush the red node. Alright, let's see what where fate uh, steers us. It steers us south. That was the least uh, beneficial transfer I've ever seen. Oh, well. Here. We'll grab that in just a moment. Just going for what matters first. That thing's probably going to piss it off. No, it didn't. No, it did not. Alright, now this is going to... Of course, the two pissed it off. Okay. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Got the XP's, got the V-Bucks. Let's see what we got here. We have an email that mentions an OCM. Hmm. We also have... Let's see. An Smart Disk. I wonder what that's about, huh? And there's a holographic display table somewhere, okay. Also stuff about biological interfaces burning out more quickly than anticipated. Hmm. And then we have a couple of guys being assholes to each other. Not really though, they're just jokingly being assholes apparently. And security measures, we've seen this. All right. Now you're gonna say, well that was cool. But no, that's not all. There's more. Okay, didn't piss off anyone. Just wanted to make sure. What do we have in here? We have another computer, and more importantly, a silencer. So that new pistol we just got, I'm going to combine it with this. And also rotate that. There we go. That'll do. Need more, need more ammo for a little pistol. This is going to be... It's not going to be really our lockpick, like it would be for Grimoth, but it'll be our way of knocking down walls whenever I'm out of battery power. Because we will be stopping by the loading bays again. There's plenty of good stuff to get in there. In fact, something that I forgot to get last episode, which I'm sure I've been told about about 15 million times in the comments of last video, but I do know about it. We'll get that when we actually go back to Quinn. Go ahead and grab this. It really can't beat us. We have 18 seconds remaining. It's almost sad. Let's see. A guy being bored. Talking about his lazy ass friend. Mm -hmm. And Burke's being an asshole too. Which is his birthright. And here we have a little... Since everyone's so bored over here, we have a little code thing. And I actually have never bothered to figure out what the hell this says, so... If someone wants to leave what it says in the comments, I would greatly appreciate it. Let's see, implementation new mess schedule, I think we've seen that. Security measures, we've seen that. Alright, that's not all. As always. Let's see. Alright, we're gonna... No, this is a good time. See, I'm pretty sure I can stow you in a place where he won't see you. At least I'm hoping I can. Alright, let's sit tight and get out the stun gun. You shouldn't be able to see him over there. Guess we'll find out soon enough. Of course, now we have some laser beams. Alright, don't you see that body? There we go, you're taken out. Not a big problem. What you got for us? You got 110? I checked the other guy before. I don't think I did. I was so hurried with getting him to cover. 
I didn't take his beer in 70 cents. All right, let's go ahead and... Er, er, er. Why you got me pain? Can I rotate you around? I want to push him into the laser beams. There we go. That's better. And we can pass through the lasers without any issue. Don't you freaking zap on while I'm passing. That'd be rude. Anything else over here? I don't think so. Let us take a little look-see. Well, here we have a detention camp, which is where we'll be going next when we uh, rejoin the main quest. Let's see, what else do we have over here? This looks important. Ah, uh, yes, this is a security office. Who ever heard of dispersing poisonous gas via the ventilation? You gotta be crazy. Hmm. That does sound pretty crazy. Who ever heard of dispersing poisonous gas via the ventilation? You gotta be crazy. <laughs> I'm interested to see how long he's gonna go with this. Turn off some cameras. You gonna say it again? I'll take your storage device. What'd you give me? What'd you give me? So you gotta go your inventory lethal, it's important. Let's see, what we got here? A data storage device, much like the one we got from Keitner. I actually did not point this one out earlier. This one will uh, let us put our, or not our, but Corporal Allen Tyler's biometric data on the security mainframe, which is important. What does this one do? Well, this one seems to have information about OCM Panchia, one through five. Interesting. You're not going to say it again? Okay, I'll give you a hug then. There you go. I ended up on your chair, sir. How that happened is beyond me. Let's go ahead and get you stowed away somewhere nice, because I do see an arrow on my radar. It would be a shame if they saw you. You also have more ammo for me, that's good. Let's see... I should have picked up that ammo can upgrade earlier. I mean, I'm going to be going to the loading bays anyway, so I can pick it up then, right? All right, let's see. You go there, beer, you go with the other beers. Uh, hmm. You can stay there, and you can move up. There you go. Actually, I got a good place. You can go there, and you can go there. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Still have a pretty full inventory, but it's fine. It is not an issue at the moment. I always have a weapon cabinet with a, a couple of machine pistols, if that's your thing. Let's see what this guy's email has. A sit rep, of course, about us on the boat. Let's see, Tyler Klein is bored. We hacked his computer not too long ago. And let's see, office pickup notice. Make sure to pick up your care packages, otherwise you will not receive them. And, of course, we've seen the stuff about all the religious services here at Rifleman Mag Station. There's quite a few of them. Let's see. Oh, beer. More beer. Just what I need. I think I should just have one of every flavor. I really have too many now. Oh, well. Whatever. Is there anything else in here? I actually did not see where this went yet, so let's go ahead and see. Looks like it leads to the room across the hall. Doesn't appear that the arrow's in here, but I bet you he's behind that wall. Okay, this thing is fully loaded. Go ahead and holster that shit. Stun gun darts, yeah. Definitely something I like. What you got? An M binder. I can't grab that. Can't grab the red. I'm gonna have to do it legit. Although it's about the same number of nodes. About being exactly the same number of nodes. Access bucks. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Requisition uh, request. Okay. That's cool. Black market. Hmm. Specifically comfort materials, huh? Perhaps we're talking about big weapons. I don't see any big weapons. Oh, oh. Yep, there's the big weapons. I forgot those were in here, and then I remembered. Ooh, a book. We've seen this one before, about the Illuminati. Let's see, and there's a guy on the other side of this wall. 
If I broke it, I'd kill him. You know I don't want to do that. Cameras are off, though. Cameras are off. Ooh, I see a... I see a vent in your room, sir. Let's see. Let's wait for him to move. Because I'm pretty sure he will. There he goes. guys just don't have that much that many credits a few but not that much all right harvester concerns talking about our good old buddy mr referee and how the relationship between bell tower and them is kind of tenuous Let's see security contract can't remember exactly what that one's about but it's not important mm-hmm all right great stuff more big weapons. These guys love the big weapons. They're the, <laughs> they're the favorite. All right, let's pull you into this. As is our tradition. There you go. Now let's see where this leads. It's really all this episode has been. Going through vents, going through walls. Oh, what we got here? Credit chip with uh, 200 credits. Also 200 experience. We've got two practice points now. A nuke fires and an energy boost jar. Which you know what? Can I pick that up? I'm just gonna eat that thing right now for one battery. Cause I'm crazy. It's such a goddamn waste. Oh well. I was hungry for that delicious energy jar. You don't know, man, it's like vanilla milkshakes. It's just irresistible. Alright, I think that's all. Of course, like I pointed out earlier. Why not waste, waste that whole energy jar on this wall? I just thought about that as I punched. <laughs> Whatever. Do what I want. Alright, we have a tension down here. And I, I was going to say, I see our friend laying face down on the ground. That's perfect. Let's go ahead and see what's up here. Oh, this will be perfect also, because I think this leads back to the uh, loading bay too. Alright, we got two dudes, two cameras. Not that. Bad. Fall down. Fall down. Fall down. There we go. Put that down. He shouldn't be able to see the body. The, the feet may be sticking out. Did you see it? Nope. That's good. Perfect. Just like I planned it. He's all God damn it, surprise hugs. I never asked for surprise hugs. All right. Well, perfect. These guys, of course, have the uh, view of the cameras. Beer. Because I need more beer. Mm-hmm. Some credits. All right. Let's go ahead and wait for this thing to swivel back. We're actually next to some very, very important offices, as you're about to see. We're going to hack through this one to my left in just a moment. All right. This should be good. Get it, get it, get it. Okay. We should have plenty of time to do this. Grab it. We're going for the red node. Even though this is a time of urgency, I will not pass up the cubes. It has to be a really dire circumstance for me to pass up cubes. Come in. There we go. You know whose office this is, folks? Well, let's take a look. This is... Pieta, Pieta Books office. Well, fancy that. Let's see what he has on his computer. Well, it's pretty easy to hack, I'll tell you that much. We gotta go through two very easy nodes and then just take take the red one, unsuspecting. Access granted. And 100 XP is our reward, along with some very interesting information. So, we have a request for a wall safe. Ha! Huh. Ha! Huh. Interesting. Let's see, we have congratulation on his promotion from the co-managing director and president himself. Let's see, take a read. Uh-huh, Hydra's nerve extension. Talking about test subjects. 
And we also have a chat log here between Silver and Burke. Talking about casualties. Hmm. What else we got here? Newspaper. I was going to say, I think this is the same one we saw earlier. Looks like it. And we have this. Geithner, any reason Burke's got a spare retinal prosthesis lying around his office? He just received it this evening from the Tai Young Medical Corporation. HQ had a custom set made especially for him as a thanks for so many years of good service. Why? He'll probably be real angry when he realizes it's missing. Jensen out. And if you didn't know, folks, we picked up something very interesting. Burke's revolver! And I found his wall safe very, very quickly. So this one is like any other revolver, except it has the full bevy of upgrades. Plus it has a laser on it. It can take a silencer? Shit, I should have put the silencer on there. God damn it, I didn't know it could do that. Especially since it has so much damage output. I wonder if I could buy another one. That's weird. That's weird. I, I mean, it clearly has a spot for it, right? And this is a spot for the explosive ammo. I don't know how the hell you'd, you know, silence that, but hey, weirder things have happened in this game. Let's see, what else does it have that's cool about it? Eh, not too bad. Not too bad at all. All right, well, we got a sweet-ass revolver. And I'm sure this will upset him, too, just like his missing prosthesis. I'll drop a few things of beer. He's going to need a drink when he notices this baby's gone. I am taking his whiskey, though. That's the good stuff. Coalition for Liberty, we've seen that. Let's see, anything else in this room I want? Even though there's tons of bottles, there's only one of whiskey. Well, shoot. I didn't know I could put the silencer on this. At least it looks like it. I may not be able to. I'm going to have to try it off camera if I can't buy one from, uh, from Quinn. What we got here? The Bell Tower Way. Huh. So I wonder whose office this is, folks. Let's go ahead and take a look at the computer. Oh, well, this is Keitner's. There you go. We'll see what information she has on her computer. Because why not? There we go. Another very easy to hack computer with an additional 100 experience Access on it. Granted. Actually, 200 additional experience on it. Plus the 75 for hacking it anyway. We have a conversation between what appears to be Keitner and possibly a team. Maybe. Maybe. Let's see, we have information about Burke. Loading pods directly in the three. Mm -hmm. And into the detention camp. All right. And we did a database search on the pod ID numbers, but they tur nothing turned up. Very interesting. Of course, we have her talking to the director of personnel about Burke being a dick. And we also have an email between her and Pieter himself. And, yes, she was part of the Israeli's defense force. She also has some photos up here. A portrait of herself. Some kind of diploma here. It's too pixelated in Hebrew for me to understand it. Let's see. Oh, and there's also something else that's very, very good to pick up. Another damage upgrade. My goodness. Also, it appears... That I have automatic sorting back on. Darn it. Piss and vinegar. Okay, let's turn that off. It's probably just... You know what? I'll keep it on for now. Because we're going to see Quinn pretty darn soon. Let's see, stun gun darts. Always a good thing to pick up. 25 credits. Sheen pistol ammo. Nothing I really desire there. All right, well, that was cool. I can't remember where the controls for this are. Was there actually more in here? Yeah, this goes back this way. Let's keep following this. I think it actually leads us to something we want to see. And if it doesn't, then we'll come back. Well, it's going down far enough to be interesting. What do we got over here? A computer. And we can turn off cameras with it. Well, that's just perfect. I was just looking for one of those. And let's see. We have a 
a scholar book here. I'm not going to read it, but we have some additional ones with the Missing Link DLC. And here we go. It's again but from our good friend Hugh Darrow. Let's see. Can't go anywhere. What the heck is that? What is this mysterious panel on the wall? Can't get the red. Two cubes. Let's go this way first. We'll just go right through the cube like it's not even there. 100 experience already. I like this pad. There we go. Grab that. Grab this. Grab this. And force both of these. Wait for that to get to 50. That should be plenty of time. 150 additional experience. And we can turn off the lasers. Which I think this is the same area that I uh, had the dude in. The one that I took off, took down and actually put on the laser beams. So there we go. I guess we don't have to worry about those anymore. And we have this floor panel, which opens with this thing right here. So you could hack that earlier. Any cameras? No cameras. Cameras have been disabled. That's good. And now we can walk pretty much wherever we want. Here's the ar army operations where we started. I don't think Quinn actually has one of those silencers, which is a goddamn shame. Where does this go? We're going to go see Quinn in just a moment. But I want to see where this goes first. Oh, this looks interesting. We've actually been here before. You know what? Well, shit. Can I survive that fall? Er, yes, I actually didn't even take any damage. Cool. Er, well, I, I forgot this passage even existed. We're gonna have to wait for the elevator to get down here, but I'll just slam the button before I talk to Quinn. See, just a second, Quinn. Gotta, gotta get the elevator down here. Well, if it ain't my favorite and currently only customer. Let's see. About. Well, I actually entered the shop first. What are you buying? I'm not buying anything, friend, unless you have one of those silencers. Oh, he does have a silencer. I don't have enough room. Well, shit. No reef. Okay, well, I, I I need to see if this works. I'm actually going to sell this as soon as I get it. But hey, maybe I'll keep this. Maybe I'll keep this awesome That's pistol. Good. I was going to sell it. Okay, let's, uh, what are you let's go ahead and get that silencer. You know, it's cheaper. No reef. I got plenty of money. Now, can I combine this? Nope. Okay. Well, there you go. Even though it has that slot there, it confused me. I was going to say, it shouldn't go on the revolver, but hey, what the hell do I know? Just need to make sure. Okay, well, this revolver is completely worthless to me. So, what do you buy? well, it's not completely worthless because I'm going to sell it, but you know what I mean. 2,000 bones. Not too shabby at all. See you later, little Burke's pistol. And now we got all the parts. Let's go ahead and ask about the special offer. All right, tell me about this special offer. Look, I don't know if you've noticed. Yeah, 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 yes, yes, yes. We know about that. A rocket launch. That's right, me. I thought we already went through this before, right. but I guess we gotta go okay, through right. it again. Look, all you gotta do is find me some components. I'll do the rest. An earlier boat had a shipment of three. Right. So, long story short. Yeah, that about sums it up. I'd say. I think I already found some Okay, well, we'll get to hear what this sounds them. like then. That's I, weird. Let me see what you got there. Fucking deadly. That's all of them. Give me a sec with me tools. I'll get them sorted out right and proper. I guess he doesn't say anything different. Right then. That'll do you. Anything else can be helping you with then? Nah, I think I'm good. I gotta... Yeah. So he dropped it right at our feet. He just pushed it through the slot there. Let me go ahead and clear out my inventory again. I need to buy new arms. Let's see. Drop the pistol. Rocket launchers are kind of freaking gigantic. I actually do have to drop all that crud. There we go. And here it is. It's just like a regular rocket launcher, although it does have the heat-seeking apparatus on it already. Go ahead and take a look at it. Look at the size of that, mother can barely hold it. Damage output's kind of extreme, you know, because it is a rocket launcher. Reload speed's kind of terrible. I think we've seen this description before. Alright. Well, 
If it ain't my favorite and currently only customer. You know what, man? Since you put so much into this, I'm just going to give it to you. Well, not really give it to you. I'm going to sell it to you for another additional 200 V-Bucks, or 2,000 V-Bucks. You know. Satisfaction guaranteed. Unless, of course, you fuck it up yourself. Yeah, shit, shit, shit. I don't need that. Let's see, pick it up. Pick up the... S I guess I'll just pick up that because I can't see the sun gun anyway. All right, let's get this shit reorganized. Come on. Come on. Flip it. There you go. Go and drop you. <sighs> what a mess. You know what? Fuck it. I'll do that next ep episode. I'll get that all cleaned up. Uh, hmm. I, you know what? I'll just close it off here. I was going to show you one more Praxis kit, folks. But we'll do that next time since we are at exactly 30 minutes. Okay? I'll see you then.